We have had enough challenges as persons with albinism. For example, a person with albinism lacks melanin, which is a black pigment that helps protect you in the sun. Without that, our skins are very susceptible to skin cancer with the sun damages that come. So many of us are at high risk of contracting skin cancer. And the other challenge that we face is we have a very short sight. So quite often we cannot see objects that are far. This affects our daily life. Many of us drop out of school because the numbers are big, the teachers can't accommodate us. And then, coupled with this, the community increases the stigma by calling us names, thinking we are less of humans. When a child with albinism is born, it's quite often that the mother bears the burden. Many times, the fathers flee, and we are left to either the grandparents or the least, the neighbors who care. So today, we celebrate women who have stood the prejudices, who have stood the stigma, who have told society that this will not hold us down. We call upon you today, we call upon the government and everybody to reduce the stigma and discrimination that beyond the myths and prejudices, we are humans too.